Yo, what's up, guys? It's your boy, abnormally small micro penis, and today I kind of want to do a, diff a different kind of video. I'm gonna be talking about a previous group project that I had in the past. It was just like any other day, you know, waking up at six in the morning, which is wonderful from a guy who usually wakes up at twelve in the afternoon and eats breakfast at two. I had went to school, taking the bus, you know, just going to my marketing class. So the teacher's talking, and then finally she gets to the ending of the the end of the class. And she starts talking about a group project we have to do. And me being the socially awkward kid who sits in the corner and never talks to anyone, is just like baffled. I'm just wondering, like, what the hell? Like, why? Like, we're already starting group projects. And it was it was probably like a week into the semester. She told everyone, like, we're going to be starting group projects and you need to pick a group, like, right now. And I was just like no please don't like don't do this to me like you you can't fucking do this like look at me does, does it look like i'm gonna be fucking does it look like i want to talk to anyone in this class no in fact i was about to leave the classroom but the two girls who sat beside me but not directly beside me because i had my backpack like in the seat next to me just so no one would sit there so those two girls they you no, know, seeing a lonely fucking idiot like myself they come up to me and they say like hey do you want to be in our group and I just I just sat there like like oh god like I can't I don't know what to fucking say like I didn't it was I wasn't ready for this like nobody told me there was gonna be a test today and I just sat there I kind of stared at them like the, these girls were like looking at me with their their heart and they're just like like we want you in our group like you were the one destined to be in our group and I just sat there like, like not nah, man that like that ain't me but i had to uh, i had to answer so i just said like uh yeah sure like i guess that's okay and they're like okay great and i'm like hey yeah that's it's great yeah I, I, I love it we end up talking about the group project a like for like a minute because i'm just like like hey i just want to get out of here fuck this class you know i just want to go up to the library and watch the fucking newest episode of stranger things and these girls are like just just looking at me with their hearts content like we need to get this project done now and i'm just like like hey man like it's doing a couple weeks like we can take our time you know just message me if you need anything done with it so we don't do it for like well, any time any week they're not talking to me i'm not talking to them finally the like two days before the project is due they come up to me and they say like hey we need to get this project done and I was just like like I've done my part like what about you guys and they're like uh, no so I'm like okay uh, just send like whenever you get the chance just send me your parts and they're like okay okay you know I figured they I figured they would send it that same day but uh, apparently they had a different idea they thought hey let's send it to, you know tomorrow the day it's due so finally the next day i get their projects the projects do it at like 11:59 at night so i'm waiting for the project they finally submit it to me at 10 p.m and i'm just like like what the fuck and you think like you know that's fine like yeah i can get this done like it wasn't it wasn't that bad just put it all together and then finish it i look at their work the one person had just sent me so the group project had to at least be seven or ten pages long. My part was about three pages long. The one girl sent me her part. It was a paragraph, literally, like, literally one paragraph long, and she had sent it in the email from the school. There was no Word document. It was nothing. It was literally just an email with a paragraph of information and I'm pretty sure she didn't even look up that information because it was just it was just bullshit and then the other girl sends me her part and I'm like wow this looks this looks amazing like this was really well done and I'm like reading through it I'm like wow like that's perfect I put it all together I can't I can't revise any of the girls uh, stuff because it's 10 o'clock and they hadn't done anything I think it was more like 10 30 and an hour and a half to get together the finishing group project to re to reevaluate like what everyone had done and to see like if they had done a good job 
is very difficult. So the project had asked for eight font and like double space and shit like that. And I, like, I was just like, like, we're not going to make fucking 10, seven to 10 pages if we do fucking whatever we have. Like we had at least five max or six with me and the other girls. And I'm like, we're like unready. this, this is not going to make it. Like we are fucked. I put the font together. I I get everything done, and the font's like size 72. Like I'm get I'm pushing. I'm pushing it to the fucking limit. Like the teacher's gonna look at this and be like, these guys are, you're, you're a fucking idiot. And I hand it in, and we get the project back a couple weeks later. And the girl who I thought like you know I did a really good job, we get it back. All, at least most of our work was plagiarized. And I'm just like, holy shit. Like, we get the work done. They're sitting beside me. Like, I don't even want to look at them. Because we had got, like, this was, like, this was 20% of our final mark. And we had gotten a 30, 30% on it. And I'm just like, holy shit. And I sit there like the awkward kid I am. And I'm just like, like, yeah, here, here's the paper. And they, and they get it back. And they look at me like, what the fuck did you do? And I'm thinking to myself, like, you've got to be kidding me like you're gonna look at me like that like i've done all of this work and you look at me like that like as soon as as soon as they looked at me like that i got up i took my shit and i just left the one girl's part was fully plagiarized and neither of them had sent me fucking references to any of the sites they used so like I could I had no idea like what I was supposed to do like I, I had messaged them back as soon as they had sent their information I messaged them back saying like hey like we need references for this no no response like they just fucking disappeared off the face of the planet I talked to the teacher about it and I'm like hey like these girls like really like screwed me over like I tried my best and they did nothing I know that's my fault but like could you give me a break like I had like we did a peer evaluation I'd given them both like zeros because they did nothing for me and the teacher's just like like nope can't do anything I'll check those uh, plagiarized things that you got and uh, that's it and I just like look at her like like kill me please like you, you just you just fucked me over this, this, here's my ass you've been gaping it thank you so I just left I was like, thank you, yeah, thanks for all you've done, with a smile on my face, because you, you gotta act like, hey, you love your teachers. And, uh, yeah, that was it. So, moral of the story is, you know, leave as fast as you can if the teacher says it's a group project, so you don't get stuck with people like that. Uh, peer evaluations do nothing. Like, nothing at all. I had wished they had done something, because I would have gotten a better mark. But, uh, you know, what can you do? Anyways, I hope you liked that video. If you enjoyed it, please be sure to subscribe. And, and don't forget to leave this video a like. And share with your friends if you want. I mean, it's not that bad, right? Anyways, uh, I'll be heading off. So, see you guys next time. Next time.